Hey Pokey Fam, what's going on? Welcome back to another video. Uh, today is another episode of Shield Collectors Please Look Away. Unfortunately, I cannot, and uh, today, as I hinted to in last week's video with the Galarian Rapidash V-Box opening, that was a mouthful. We're opening up this tin right here. Um, it was the most budget option I could find for a, uh, any box set or collector thing that gave love to the Hoenn region. Um, cause if you guys have been following my videos, uh, I've started in January by giving the Kanto region some love, then in February I gave the Johto region some love, March I took the rest of the month off and skipped Hoenn, so we're giving the Hoenn region some love, and then later this month, if not the first week of June, we'll be giving the Unova region some love. Uh, so my goal is to basically go through each, um, generation and give each region a little bit of love each month to celebrate the 25th anniversary. So without further delay, let us go down below and see what we can pull out of this tin. I am super excited about it. Um, kind of wish that there were more than four packs, but you know, it is what it is. All right, so here is our Hoenn love appreciation video it's commemorating the 25th anniversary. Uh, sealed collectors, you're encouraged to look away now. It is officially no longer sealed. Here is our Swampert EX promo. This is really pretty. Horribly off-center, though. Back doesn't look too bad, but the front's terrible. But that's all right. I don't even. I don't really care. It's just gonna go on my binder. Um. Here is a code card for all you lovely people. And let's get out our packs. We got Roaring Skies. Roaring Skies. Primal Clash. Ooh. I love this pack selection. I haven't opened any of these in a hot minute. I am super excited. Put this bad boy. Put him right here to give us some luck. All right, so we'll begin and end with Roaring Skies. Uh, Phantom Forces will go before Primal Clash, I believe. Code card right there. I believe the trick from XY is three from the back. I don't really know. Double Dragon Energy, make sure that's focused. Tropius, an underrated as heck Pokemon. Ooh, Skyfield. Inke. Ooh, that's a really cute Togepi. Execute. Not two. Fletchling. Reverse Hollow Gligar. And a Talonflame for the rare. Even if this tin is like a total whiff, like there's no hits in it, it's still a treat to open up these older tins. Um, one thing I wish I would have gotten my hands on before everything like skyrocketed was the black and white era tins. Phantom Forces, there you go. Um, cause I have, I opened up one Lugia EX in way back in the day, and I absolutely, Trick Coin, Shauna, adore the artwork from Black and White, it's a very nostalgic era for me, especially like Plasma Freeze, Plasma Storm, and, uh, Plasma Blast. Ooh, Chansey, shout out to Mama Chansey on Instagram, that is a gorgeous Chansey artwork. Carablast, Jeltic. Pumpkaboo, Reverse Hollow Mighty Anna. Ooh, I gotta keep that. And a Diggersby. Okay. Primal Clash. I even actually tried to get like some Primal Clash booster pack or not booster, uh, blisters or something. But when I saw the prices, I'm like, I can't afford that. My wallet says no. Three. Our first white code card. Kakuna, Linoon, Vibrava, I need a Flygon for my collection, Torchic, Meryl, don't know if I have that, Surskit, a 3 star Surskit still evades me in Pokemon Go, Sandit, oh, I meant Zigzagoon, I was reading its attack, Trico, 
Reverse Hollow Dive Ball, very pretty. And, ooh, Ancient Drake Gorbis. Is that hollow? No, that's not hollow. That is really pretty. I love the Ancient Drake cards. Can we get some last pack magic from this final Roaring Skies pack? Let's see. I'm loving the Hoenn vibes though from that Gorbis. Got a white code card. Can we pull a Rayquaza EX? That would be awesome. Glade Spirit Link. Wide Lens. Fletchender. Meowth. Cascoon. Alucha. I just realized I have a bunch of cards from this set because I opened it, oh, quite a bit of this set back in the day as well. Inkay. Alucha Reverse. And. Woo! Hoenn vibes all day long. I love this Altaria card. This is beautiful. Getting closer to getting all those ancient trait cards from my collection. Awesome. So, as you can see, we didn't get any hits, but we got lovely promos, some cards I needed for my collection as everything's falling everywhere. Um, this was a lot of fun to open up, so I'm really happy we opened it. Really fun pin to open up, even if we didn't get any hits, as you saw down below. But we did get cards I needed for my collection, so I'm happy about that at the very least. Um, if you guys like stuff like this, go ahead and drop a like, and consider subscribing to my channel. I do Pokemon card openings typically, um, and I'm debating whether or not to do uh, time lapses of... I have little uh, Mega Construct figures that come out right the 25th anniversary. I'm debating whether or not to do time lapse builds of those at some point on here. Let me know if the comment section doesn't get disabled. Let me know if you guys would like to see that. Um, cause I will more than do that, um, cause they're a lot of fun to build, but anyway, I digress. Um, I will see you guys on Sunday with another episode of Sunday Shorts. Um, so until then, PokeFam, I want y'all to stay awesome, and be the reason somebody smiles today. A little bit of kindness goes a long way. I'll see you guys later. Bye!